Hey there YouTube, this is SJM4306, back with another video. So, I've been working on this for the past week. I had to order a new uh, chip because I actually couldn't find any. And then lo and behold, the day after I order it, I found a random unlabeled bag that I had put the chips in. So I did have spares, so as soon as I could, I resoldered the new one, flashed the firmware, wired everything up. This is a very tight fit. As opposed to the DMG Game Boy that I did, which was actually pretty easy to fit everything in, there's plenty of room. There's barely any room in here. So what I have is um, the biver biversion mod. So I've removed the polarizing filter off this LCD and I rotated it at 90 degrees. So it's kind of a darker color now when it's off. And then this chip here is a uh, XOR, quad XOR chip. And so I'll, I wired this as a essentially a not gate so that it'll take the LCD data and then invert it again. So it's inverted once in the, the physically in the polarizing filter and another time digitally. So the color that comes up on the screen is normal to your eyes, but higher contrast. And I fit the touch sensor barely fits. I mean, there's a little bit of a gap here and the power switch wiggles a bit because of that. I can shave maybe a tiny bit off, maybe like a millimeter or something off um, the sides in order to get this to fit a little tighter, but this is just proof of concept. So this is the touch sensor to change the color. There's still a bug. When I turn this on, it'll, as soon as it boots up, it automatically changes the color once, even if you're not pressing the button. That might have to do with like a power-up issue um, because I am running this off of a, um, a, a separate switching converter so that I can generate five volts from the 3.3, uh, from the three volt batteries. So I am having the issue of this is going to be dimmer than the DMG one just because these AAA batteries can't give as much power as the four AA batteries. So it's definitely viewable in the dark. It looks amazing in the dark. So that's not that big of a deal to me. And everything all works, so I'll do a, a quick demo. I'm going to take you into a dark room, though, because it's going to be pretty darn near impossible to see with all this glare and whatnot. But yeah, you can see everything fits it is it is a ridiculously tight fit in here <laughs> so i'm happy that i got everything and so let's do that demo right now okay let's switch her on you can see it, it switched colors a few times there and uh if i can get this focus there is some color bleed there's some kind of weird uh damage to the lcd this is actually an old lcd that i've modded a lot so there's going to be some physical damage to unfortunately nothing i can really do about that but if we can get this guy to focus, come on, focus, you feck. <laughs> this is maybe going to be the best I can do. Okay, you can sort of see here, um, purple's kind of hard to see to begin with. But if I switch the color, pink is also kind of hard. Yellow, you can see right there. Look how high of a contrast that is. I can change the contrast now, but the blacks are actually black. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I'm not used to seeing this high contrast. Orange looks really good in, in real life as well, a little better than on the camera. Then we got white, which looks amazing. Red is really hard to see on here. I, I have to kind of turn the contrast down a little more than in real life. Green is really vibrant. <laughs> you can see it right there. There you go. Blue is also kind of hard to see, but a lot better actually than the DMG. And this, the cyan color is absolutely amazing. It's stunning. And we just cycle through again. Yeah, this this color looks absolutely amazing. <laughs> yeah, so you can see that everything works perfectly. I can just, you know, start up the game. It's really unfortunate about this damage to the sides and whatnot. I'm probably going to buy another broken Game Boy Pocket just for the LCD. I'll buy one with like battery corrosion or that's heavily damaged physically. But yeah, you can see. Everything works. Okay. 
it's really hard playing through the viewfinder. <laughs> we ah invincibility frames. I can't get in there. Yeah, you can see everything works, and it looks absolutely amazing. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I just wanted to make a quick video. I'm, I'm just going to sit here and play around all day. But yeah, this is uh, really cool how, how vibrant that is. I don't know if I can zoom in even more but yeah before I, I go through and play an entire game well uh, you guys are just busy watching yeah happy New Year's um, sort of a early morning New Year's Day video for me so yeah uh, here's to many 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 more mods and videos in the upcoming year and I'll see you guys later